right, this is just a little entertainment. We've always wondered about this crossing we cross on the way to our friend's house, Remy and Diane. And uh, I just wanted to see it is all. And now that I'm seeing it, I can see that it's pretty bad. The Jeep goes down another five foot pit in order to cross this, so I would never cross this today. But uh, as you can see, it's pretty bad today. <coughs> Yeah, that goes down another five feet and dips in, so. That's amazing. I have never seen it this bad. And we cross here once in a while, just for the fun of it, you know. But uh, this is a bad day today for rain. We can get some more videos here and show you how bad it is. Okay, we are on Highway Edge, as you can see out in front of us here. See how beautiful it is today. But you notice it's raining really hard. And uh, we thought we would do a video where we went to different places in the city to show people uh, what it looks like, where it's flooding. I didn't know it was a, such a flood prone area. I know that there is flooding, but just not so deep. Let's show you the first one. Coming up here on the right hand side, uh, water is so thick it's going into the field and cutting the field and going into the ground. I'll show you over on the right here. going into the ground. Oh man, it's going into the ground. Let's see how it goes down and under the road surface here. All right, well that's one place where it's really, really interesting. Go ahead. Another spot is this one here. As you can see, the fields are flooded. And they too go under the road. Go ahead and show them they go into the road there. Now I don't wonder anymore why it is that we have so much when it comes to um, the water, why we have so many rivers underground. Now I know why. Another classic example is the city park, as you see here. Look at this. You ever see that before? <laughs> it was coming out much heavier earlier when we came by, but that's the city park. Everybody recognizes the city park. We'll take you to another spot here. And this is Highway 19, right when you get into the beginning of Salem. It's flooded so bad that the uh, the creek that there's usually not too much water in has overflowed the bridge almost. Earlier it was a lot higher. It was actually going over the bridge a little bit. But here you can't see it as much. But uh, there it is. As you can see there. Almost, almost overflowing over this bridge by that house that everybody recognizes. Here in the other little city park that begins in Salem, so. But yeah, it's been flooding really bad. Let's go home. All right, I've noticed that as we've been going, the road has been flooded in a lot of places where the water goes all the way across the road even. It's, it's that deep. I mean, it's, this is going back home. We've hit several of these water across the road spots and it's pretty thick out here. And uh, you see it's here, there, and everywhere. It's it's better here than it was earlier. Earlier it was really bad because earlier it crossed the road here. Woo! My goodness. Anyway, yeah, we're almost home. I'll pause it until we get home. And the other thing I noticed is they have a trash problem here. But uh, this creek, which is usually empty, uh, let me open Eva's window and let her show out that one. The creek that's usually empty is uh, now flowing with water. You can back it out a little bit so they can see it. It's flowing with water. Let me show on this side. In this, in this Over here. Look at that. Usually there's no water. But anyway, okay, well that's our fun day of flooded here in Salem, probably everywhere else, but, but uh, we're almost home anyway, so. Eva, here you go, and uh, goodbye to everybody, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, if you did, hit uh, like and uh, subscribe. <laughs>
Okay, we are back home. And as you can see, it's flooded everywhere. Even the neighbor's pond is about to cross the street over there. But uh, yeah, so that's uh, the reason our basement floods because there's a, there's a pond in the front yard all the time. Big old pond. It's drying up now because it stopped raining, but it was a lot of rain earlier. It wasn't stopping for nothing, so. All right, that's it for now. Bye-bye.